Hey guys, welcome back. So, continuing from where we left off, we're going to uh, need to apologize what we created this dress for uh, our female character. But before we do that, there's a few things I need you guys to know about that right uh, from starting from the left top over here, there is a toolbar. Uh, which gives you this option about editing curve points and editing curvature so these two things I'm gonna go through them right now so curve points when you select these you can drag select and move them just like that so you see how they update in real time and by pressing space you can simulate that again and let's say I want it to be up there again yeah it's uh, a lot better and now for the edit curvature you can drag this down to make it round Okay, cool. So now that we've done that, the next thing we are going to do is create the topology by going into this menu over here. Here you can see that we have something called patch topology. I'm not going to use that one in this tutorial. I'll show you guys later on maybe how to use patch topology. It's faster, but sometimes it can create some errors. What we're going to do is create topology manually by clicking this create topology button it's the shortcut key for it is u by default and edit topology is y we're going to be shifting in between these two a lot so make sure to remember the shortcut keys for it it's so going into edit topology let's put one That's how we've created a polygon. Even I used to do this inside of uh, Maya by the quad draw tool and it was a pretty long process, but now Marvelous kind of just offered you this setup, so why wouldn't we use it? I mean makes your life so much easier. Just re apologize it over here. So we have this uh, nice curve going on for a uh, neck. Make sure you make that. By pressing Control, Shift, and left click, you can add edge groups as well. Anything to know about? Now you see this is uh, a bit tilted, it's because it's uh, trying to average out according to uh, its algorithm, but we need this to be straight, so I press Y, as you guys remember, to go into edit topology mode, and are back into 
straight to pausey mode by pressing U. Pressing Y again. So this is uh, how you can go in and out and just create that topology how you need it. I'm going to just fast forward this portion because it's just me going through motions of topology. Nobody wants to sit and watch me do this. But I mean if you do, you can slow down the video. I'm gonna speed this part up. So we have the front side done and we need to pretty much repeat this process for the back and you can see that it's created highlights for us as to where we have the main points which is a good feature from all this design I mean it makes sure that we have the same amount in the back as we do in the front. Okay, so uh, we've done the front side and we're going to repeat the same process for the back side again, which is pretty much just going through the same motions as we did for the front. So I'm just going to skip that part because I want to show you guys the cool thing that you can do with this. But to get to the cool thing, you have to go to the tedious part. So I'm going to skip this and in the next video where I'll start from both of these things re-topologized on how to uh, export both the uh, previous thing that you can use and this one with their UVs.